At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson, and we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It is Manchester City versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Manuel Akanji plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Ilkay Gundogan plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Erling Haaland. That's going to be a City ball. Rodri. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And fed forwards. And they do like to press whenever they can. But well, it's always a great thrill to watch Erling Haaland in action. He can be absolutely unstoppable, and we should expect that he'll have a prominent role to play in this one, Stuart. Well, he comes alive around the box. He's so good at backing into defenders, rolling away from them, and then getting off his shots quickly. He's so difficult to mark, and that's why he's their leading goal scorer. Well, he could really get at the opposition. Gundogan. Easy save for David De Gea. Casemiro. Bruno Fernandes. And he takes on the shot. No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. Riyad Mahrez. Well, lovely work to get past his man. Has a go. Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop. And now the delivery. And the keeper takes the ball, but the main thing is he held on to it. Ericsson. Failure to keep it there from Gundogan in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Had to come up with the ball and did. Martial. No worries for the keeper. Mares. And showing fine vision. And United have it back. Grealish shot attempted every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one well this has to get better because as those stats confirm the attacking play from both sides just hasn't been good enough it's all been a little bit too cautious so far determined defending Bit of running room now on the wing. Crossing into the middle. Well, the only way to say it is he got it all horribly wrong, Stuart. Well, he has to make the keeper work harder than that. That's a tame finish. 
Playing advantage here. United keep it. And the referee's whistle. That will conclude the first half here at Wembley. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Martial could be and a goal for United! The opener in the final and it could be hugely significant. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. So underway again here, one nil to score. Bruno Fernandes, and now Rashford trying his luck from long range. Well, in some style, Edison prevents a goal. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, no problems defensively. Bruno Fernandes oh managing to beat him and as a defender you really have to concentrate to the maximum to bar the door as he did then Gundogan Akanji has it Manuel Akanji definitely look as though they want to make this move count Rodri the supporters want to see him have a go just made sure nothing came of that and United will switch things around personnel wise Kevin De Bruyne with the corner and a super header it looked as though it might be going in. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Now they stopped them in their tracks. And very deftly cut out. Christian Eriksen threads it through. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Bruno Fernandes. And he's broken free. And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and what a clinical finish this is from Martial. He hits it with such power. That's a good goal. Goal for Manchester so back United. underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Anthony Martial!
Rashford. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Mares in the advanced position, but will they be able to produce? Grealish. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. Casemiro. Here's Martial now. Ericsson. And just five minutes remaining. Jaden Sancho. Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. And he might be through here. Not out of the woods yet. Well, they can bring it out now. Fernandes. Oh, did so well to deny him. Here's a change for Manchester United. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And the problem not completely solved. Oh, body in the way, crucially. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The Cup winners! Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a Cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team, and now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. Now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.